Good morning. Welcome to Devotions in the Proverbs. I'm Pastor Corby Johnson, and today is April 9th, 2021. It's a Friday, so everyone who is done with their work week, hooray, celebrate! <laughs> and for those of us who work a little bit on the weekend, you got this. <laughs> today we are on chapter 12, verses 22 through 28. And I'm going to read this two different ways in the New International Version. Now, you can always read this in your favorite version. I like to read many versions and then choose the one that I think really stands out for me. So I hope this one stands out for you today. I'm going to go slowly um, so that you can write down some words to describe the way you live and words that others would use to describe you. That'll be fun, won't it? So, let's begin. The Lord detests lying lips, but delights in people who are trustworthy. The prudent keep their knowledge to themselves, but a fool's heart blurts out, blurts out folly. Diligent hands will rule, but laziness ends in forced labor. Anxiety, <laughs> anxiety weighs down the heart, but a kind word cheers it up. The righteous choose them, their friends carefully, but the way of the wicked leads them astray. The lazy do not roast any game, but the diligent feed on the riches of the hunt. In the way of righteous, there is life. Along that path is immortality. We've got some heavy hitting words of description in this proverb, don't we? So I want to take each of the positive characteristics, and I hope you already circled or underlined some of what you heard today along the reading. So for good words, things to attain in life, to be trustworthy, to be prudent, to be diligent, to be kind, and to be righteous, and to have life. Not just life muttering through, but a good life. That's the hope and prayer for all of us, isn't it? Our activity today is, I want you to choose one verb, one verb that you think you need to focus on in your life. Remember, a verb is an action, so how you want to act in your life. I'd like you to write a short note to yourself about the characteristic, and just pick one characteristic that you would like to encourage in your own life. One good characteristic that you would like to focus on and encourage in your life. And I'm going to say, <laughs> write it down, 
then maybe you'll want to write it in script or bold letters and maybe decorate it a little bit so it catches your eye. Color always helps me. And then every time you see that word, say, that's who I am. Now I'm going to say these good words again and pause and allow you to say, that's who I am. Trustworthy. Prudent. Diligent. Kind. Righteous. And life. That's who I am. Our focus verse today is verse number 28. So Proverbs 12, verse 28. In the way of righteousness, there is life. In the way of righteousness, there is life. Along that path is immortality. Along that path is immoral immorality. <laughs> immortality, sorry. <laughs> immortality. <sighs> so, I hope that this filled your heart and your mind with some thoughts about yourself, good thoughts, um, and maybe even some of the things that were on the other side of the coin that you want to try to get over or past. Until we meet again, my friends, may the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord look his May the Lord look upon you with favor and grant you peace. Amen. I will see you Monday. God's blessings.